Hey, Aplea, I'm finally back now. I took a week off after VidCon to kind of recharge my battery and to really think about the type of videos that I wanted to put together. So all week long, I want to discuss convincing your parents to let you do certain things. I know a lot of you guys struggle with having conversations with your parents about certain topics. And in this video, I really want to focus on talking to them about getting you a smartphone or even just letting you use your smartphone more often. So if that's something you're struggling with and you want tips on how to do it, this this video is going to help you. For those of you that are new here, my name is Josh and every single Monday through Friday I make videos sharing tips, ideas, and stories teaching you how to be your best self. Now some of the most common reasons I've heard as to why parents don't want to get their kids cell phones simply is because they think that you're going to spend too much time on it, it's going to get in the way of your schooling, or you're just not going to be responsible enough with it and you're going to be on it 24-7. I would say the first thing you should do is to showcase responsibility in other areas of your life. If your parents see that you're responsible when it comes to let's say your homework or studying for tests then they're going to start to see that hey you're able to manage tasks and you're not going to kind of goof off or slack off when it comes to doing them parents want to know that they're not just handing over a distraction for you that they're not giving you something that's going to take you away from your responsibilities so the burden kind of falls on you to hold up that end to show them that hey you're responsible you're mature and you can handle one of these things the second concern that a lot of parents have is safety they want to make sure you're not going on your phone and doing something that can get you in a lot of trouble. Whether it's setting up a social media account and talking to random strangers and giving out your address and phone number and things like that, they just want to know that you're doing things that can't hurt you later on. I've spoken to a lot of parents over the years and one of their major concerns is that their kid is going to send out a naked photo of themselves or give out their home address and have a stranger come visit them. There's always that underlying fear that, hey, you're going to make a mistake and you're not really going to think it through. So if you want your parents to be convinced that you deserve a cell phone, maybe the best thing to do is to have open access for them. If at any time they would want to look at it or go into your social media profiles to read your messages, let them do it. I know you don't really want to have them invading your privacy, but it might be what you have to give up in order to get a phone. Now that doesn't necessarily mean that your parents will do that, that they will be all up in your business and read all your messages and just kind of interfere in all your different relationships, but having the access to do it means that they'll feel way more trusting knowing that if something does start to seem a little fishy they can always jump in but it's not a guarantee that they will but the part that I think you're waiting for is how exactly you should approach that conversation or if you've already talked to your parents about it in the past how do you kind of reapproach it even though they've kind of given you a straight answer of no well I think the best way to go about it is to honestly share what you want to say hey mom dad whoever you're with can I get a cell phone? A bunch of my friends have them and I feel like by having a cell phone, I'll be able to kind of communicate better and stay up to date on what's going on in the world. Make sure to mention the two points that I outlined. Let them know that having a phone isn't going to interfere with your responsibilities of school, that you're still going to stay on task and that if it does start to interfere, you have no problem working within cutoff times throughout the night for them to set. So if it's maybe after dinner, you're not allowed to go on your phone, that's okay. Remember, you still have a phone. And then the second point, Point is the safety issue. If they feel like you're going to be doing things that they don't feel comfortable with, let them know that at any time they can jump in your phone, they can look through what you're doing, and they can feel a little bit more comfortable with you having it. Now, if you've already asked them multiple times and they continuously say no, try to ask them at what age they would feel comfortable with you having that phone. And then if that's the case and you have to wait a few years, then so be it. I remember getting my first phone when I was about 15 or 16 years old. So if you don't have one yet, don't worry. It is a process and it's something that you will eventually get. You just have to work towards getting it. But now I want to know what you think. What are your parents' thoughts on getting a cell phone? Are they okay with it? Do they tell you a certain age you have to be to get one? Share your comments down below and let's get that conversation started. But also, I put together a playlist of different videos on how to convince your parents to let you do certain things. So check that out over there on the side or is it on the side? I always forget, but check it out anyway. I have more videos on it. Keep on learning, guys. And on that note, I'll catch you tomorrow. As always, love and peace.